Hi there, students. Selenography. Selenography. Okay, this is the study of the physical features of the moon, the surface of the moon, the geography of the surface of the moon. You could also call it this selenodyssey. Yeah. Um, so effectively, it's uh, part of uh, planetary science looking at, at the moon. Now, selenography has been going on for probably 2000 years, maybe over 2000 years. Um, and the idea that the surface of the moon is not smooth is um, an idea that's a couple of thousand years old, yeah. Um, Democritus, uh, in 450 BC, uh, said that the moon wasn't flat. It had mountains and valleys, yeah. And this is why it has, um, different markings on, on the surface. And people have been making, uh, maps of the moon, uh, since, since the uh, 1600s, um, the first map was made by a William Gilbert in uh, maybe 1603. Uh, and since then, people have been lo looking at, um, the, uh, at the moon. And uh, when... Um, telescopes appeared there was a lot more uh, there was a lot more as well let's see we also actually have the word selenology selenology is just general lunar science okay selenology yeah is the study of the moon but selenography is geography it's the graphy yeah in as opposed to the ology the study of it's the graphy of the distribution of where the where the different places are um, and they've been improve, improving their maps of the moon uh, since, since the uh, early, early 17th century. Um, there are still parts of the moon that it's not clear where uh, how deep the craters are and things like that. And uh, I'm sure... The, uh, particularly in the pot, the north and south poles of the moon. Um, so th th there is still a lot of, um, selenography to do. Um, yeah. Let, let's see. People have been drawing maps of the moon. The first map of the moon is from about 3000 BC. So it goes back forever. Leonardo da Vinci made sketches of the moon. Every, all sorts of people had through, through, throughout time. Galileo made drawings of, uh, of the, of the moon as well. Okay, so selenography, the selenography, the ge geography of the moon, uh, the mapping of the moon, the lunar geography, and selenodyssey is the same thing, and then selenology, the study of the moon, yeah, selenology, um, didn't, um, science of the, of the moon. So yeah, selenography could be a, a quite quite a cool thing to do. Uh, the this the physical geography of the moon. Uh, I'm sure I'm sure if you go to internet, you'll find some very nice uh, selen selenographic maps uh, produced by NASA or people like this. So yeah, it, it's selenography. It's the mapping of the surface features of the moon. Yeah, where the mountains and the valleys and, uh, well, there are no rivers, but things that look like river, rivers are. Okay, so selenography, selenology, um, formality. I would probably give these a... 6.5 in formality, maybe a 7. Um, I would use them in a semi-formal conversation, maybe not. Semi-formal writing or a formal writing, yeah? Um, because people are going to ask, what, 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 do, what does that mean? Um, and then as to origin, uh, well, we, this comes from, uh, Selen, from, uh, ancient Greek, Selene, the moon. Yeah. And, uh, 
uh, ography, geography, uh, the loc the location of the uh, different places, the uh, mapping of it, um, graphia, uh, graphe, writing, drawing, description in ancient Greek, uh, and then selenology, ology, the st the study of. So enough. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you soon. Bye for now. Selenography, selenodicy, and selenology. <laughs>